There's Olivia Newton-John. She looks absolutely fabulous. Probably better than she did when she was in Greece. Unbelievable. Still working, still touring. She has more tour dates in April and May than you can imagine. She took a brief hiatus from her tour to come here to the Hard Rock Live in Las Vegas to personally be the recipient of their first annual award. And there she is. So, more than a million albums. I'm a big fan. You look better today than you did in Greece. Unbelievable, iconic singer, actress, Olivia Newton-John. What a thrill. And you are working so much. I saw your touring schedule. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've been working quite a lot. I finished up my residency here about four months ago. And so I've been doing some concerts and taking some time off, which has been really nice. It doesn't look like time off to me. I saw your April, May sch schedule. Where can people go to see where you're going to be? So many cities. I go to my website. I, I can't even remember where I'm going. So uh, I'll be in Florida next month. Yeah. Florida next month. Yeah. And she took off, took a little brief hiatus from her tour to come here, and you're being honored. But you have been honored, oh my gosh, just about everywhere and anywhere. It's just an amazing career. You've been so blessed. I have had an amazing career. And you're absolutely right. I am blessed. I'm very grateful for it. Yeah. And you did something that women all over the world would like to do. You danced with Gene Kelly. Oh, I know, what an experience. And John Travolta. Well, know. yeah, ha, duh. That's enough for anyone in yes. a life. Well, at my age, I'm going, yay, Gene Kelly. And of course, yay, John Travolta. Yeah, both. That was great. Xanadu, Greece, what a career. Yeah, really. And, and you have albums, you have a Christmas album that's just, I mean, everything that you're doing is just... I had a Christmas album with John Farnham, who's an Australian singer, like my favorite singer, and uh, it was a great success. And um, I've been busy and I've also recorded an album with two of my friends, Amy Sky and Beth Nelson Chapman. It's for people going through grief and loss. It's called Live On. So we've been doing concerts with them as well. And I don't have much time, but in addition to being an iconic star, you give so much of yourself uh, to philanthropic ways and, and breast cancer, you name it, you're right there. Well, I, I think that's part of my... I'm so grateful for all I've done that if I can hand it back in some way or draw attention to something, then, then I love to do that. Well, it was my pleasure meeting you in person. I'm Pepper J with the Actors Reporter. Thank you. Thank you.